Hello, people of the internet. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, a happy Wednesday to you all. Let's jump back on the V train one time. Um, I didn't realize I missed an MV. Thank you to the commenter who pointed it out for me uh, in whenever we checked out Slow Dancing that I missed one. Thank you very much because I had completely missed it, like entirely. I didn't even know that it was an MV that existed for it. So let's finish up this V project properly with one more song for us. Now, I do know there's one more piece of content technically out there. Uh, he did Slow Dancing on the first take. Don't worry. I have seen it pop up on my... Uh, subscription box i love the first take the problem is it being a japanese piece of media it's very sketchy when it comes to content id stuff so we're just gonna do for us do not worry i will watch the first take or v on the first take in some way shape, form if it doesn't make it to a video just know that i will have watched it in my free time so. with that being said this sh there shouldn't be too much that we need to talk about on this, so let's just get started with that. DJ, roll the intro. Okay, V, buttery smooth music, take. How many, how many MVs has there been, including the pre-releases? Like seven, six, I think six. Let's finish on a high. Let's see what kind of smoothness Mr. Taehyung is bringing to the table today. Here we go. Let the cursor off the screen. He's taken the end of the night concept and really run with it musically. Oh my goodness. I like that this is like a little bit of a behind the scenes slash an outtakes uh, blooper reel. It kind of does feel like the finale of the whole thing now. What just happened? Oh, goodness, the switch again? I love that slightly muffled feeling throughout the entire song in the instrumental tracks, even with all the different flavors that we got from it. really did feel like an epilogue film. That's nice. That's really kind of cute. The song, though, is very smooth and very pretty and very nice, and it's exactly kind of what I expected this to be. But, man, honestly, I... 
Until I listened to him sing that Bing Crosby um, Christmas song uh, during the holiday season last year, I did not know like Young's kind of vocal style would go into this like slow lounge jazz type vibe. But my goodness, does he pull it off. And the fact that he's done a full-on project on his own in this direction musically and done it at such a high level too is so cool. And honestly, I love that this very specific type of like music is getting the love and attention from someone as prolific as V. I think that's so cool. Is this is the type of music that as someone who grew up in America for the most part and had a parent who very much enjoys like the 1950s Americana like jazz music this is very much reminiscent of like long car journeys with my dad at the wheel because whoever's at the wheel needs to stay awake and listen to music and hence that's where like the Americana slow jazz came in but to see it done in a uh, in like a musical industry where this type of music really isn't all that common and see it succeed at the level it's doing is super cool. I do want to go back in that transition on the mountain road. I don't know what happened. That is a wild transition, by the way. Like, that is probably, out of all of the V Solo stuff that we've checked out, that is probably the only moment in any of his music that's dropped where I've thought, what the heck is going on? He saved it for the end. Interesting. I don't know how many times I've said this phrase when referring to V's music and his like solo stuff in this solo release that he's done. But he's just so smooth with it. It's not fair how buttery smooth he is with it. I just... I knew his voice was going to be something special when he made his solo debut. Just, if you listen to any Bang Tang song, you know immediately when V sing just because his voice is so different. Different in a great way, by the way, but just... His voice is so absolutely gorgeous, especially once you get it on a really smooth song with long held notes where you can just feel that vocal texture that he's got. But he's always usually shared it with a couple of other vocalists, right? To have an entire project of that very specific and absolutely gorgeous voice across the board is I don't want to call it revolutionary because that's not the right word for it, but it is spectacular. And honestly, there are like all the different flavors of the BTS solo projects that we've gotten this year. Musically speaking, now I'm not saying like in terms of the song, but musically from like a compositional and a musical style point of view, V's has been so fun. So fun. Because it's so different. That was a blast. That was a blast indeed. But that is it for me today. Thank you all for watching along with me. Hopefully you enjoyed it as much as I did. One last request from me today. Let's work together as a community to bring a little bit of extra happiness back into the world. Whether it be checking with your friends and family, holding the door open for somebody, or even picking up a piece of trash off the street. Just one small act of kindness to me, brighten up someone else day to day. And know that wherever you are in the world, should you ever be going through a tough time in your life, for whatever reason it may be, even though I'm just some guy on the internet who waffles about music in his free time, know that I will always be a friend ally and a shoulder to lean on whenever you need me so take care of yourselves take care of each other spread the love and i will see you next time bye bye